on a sweltering piece of sun-scorched African earth, somewhere near Burkina Faso's border with Motley, 10,000 people hitched rides, rode scooters, and biked to an extraordinary celebration. We're in Burkina Faso because we have an extraordinary opportunity to see how people are being impacted by a technology we developed to produce. PIX is a triple bag system. African farmers with insect infestations put their grain in plastic bags and seal them. Each bag is sealed inside another bag and the double bags are put in a third bag and tied shut. Insects can't get in and the insects locked inside run out of oxygen and water and die. To date, more than five million PIX bags at a cost between two and three dollars each have been sold and used in sub-Saharan Africa. Um, I've learned a lot from the program about hermetic storage and the importance of hermetic storage for farmers, particularly smallholder farmers who have lots of problems with insects and molds and just literally don't have a way to store their commodities that they're growing. There's a very high population of farmers who need to store their crops after harvest and generate uh, income or to have food for their families or seed to plant the following year. With these triple layered hermetic bags a farmer can store cow pea, all kinds of things for three, six, nine months. And yesterday, um, we had the opportunity to see a bag that had been closed in 2007. She says it was uh, in the same condition as it is now when she put it into storage. It was eight years in storage, and it was still in condition where it could be consumed uh, was not damaged by insects. It shows that one can store at least a food crop indefinitely in a PIX bag. The biannual event in Burkina Faso has grown tenfold in six short years to become an amazing celebration of PIX success. I expected to be positively pleased with what I saw, but the truth of the matter is I was thrilled. Uh, so many things that I saw, particularly the celebration of cowpea and storage uh, and the awarding of prizes for the use of PIX bags. Alors que PIX, qui est intervient quasiment à la récolte, donc euh, la technologie du triple assachage, c'est à la récolte que les gens l'utilisent, euh, on a très peu compris que les problèmes de conservation ou de valorisation de produits agricoles pouvait vraiment freiner carrément la filière. Et je pense que maintenant, quand les gens savent qu'ils peuvent produire, stocker, garder le temps qu'ils veulent, euh, avoir un meilleur produit et un meilleur prix. The original project, which we started in 1987, uh, had as its criterion for success not whether we would publish scientific papers, whether we would get invited to give talks or go to conferences, but whether or not, in the end, people would use the technology and benefit from it. When farmers can produce uh, 200 kilo, 300 kilo, and 400 kilo, and be able to store them in a pig's bag, and store the grain until they feel they are comfortable selling the grain, they are not worried about insect damage. I mean, that's a real impact. The other thing that a farmer can do is a store until prices get better. Um, at harvest time, usually prices are quite low. If you wait three, four, six months, the prices will be much higher. What's really important to us and to everyone, uh, including the Gates Foundation, which has supported much of the work, uh, is that the technology is not just a one-time benefit, but a sustained benefit that years into the future, people will still be using. What makes me excited is when I meet a family, a woman, who has produced even 50 kilos or 100 kilos, and she tells me that now she's able to feed her family, and she's able to provide healthy grain to her family. She's not worried that the ch children will be sick. And those are the uh, successes that make me keep going because I know I'm making a difference 
in the lives of many African farmers, especially women who struggle you know, to uh, help their families. I am happy today that Larry came in Burkina and see how this technology saved a thousand and thousand of people.